Hey everyone, it's your professional sarcastic man and seeker of attention Chris here. Here with a kind of a review of DC's New Age of Heroes. So what we have so far. So so far <laughs> we've had four titles released. We've had we've had three issues of damage, we've had two issues of sideways, we have three issues of silencer, and we have two issues of the terrifics. Um, so when DC New Age of Heroes first came out, there was really only one <laughs> series of the ones I have so far that I was interested in, and that was Terrifics. It just, I don't know, just this cover and the premise just hooked me in, and I usually, I definitely like a lot of Lemire's writing, so I definitely wanted to pick up Terrifics. The other ones, other ones I didn't, they didn't really appealed to me that much like sideways just like eh, he's just trying to be batman but not batman spider-man he's just trying to be spider-man eh, uh silencer and don't really lot of, like a lot of like uh unless it's kind of unless it's deathstrike i don't really like like mercenary special agent kind of stuff damage damage uh mm. i mean it looked good but Seeing the premise of it, I just like, yeah, I don't know. But I decided, you know, I'm going to try everything. So I did. Uh, I will be trying the future future titles as well. So here are my thoughts on what I've been so far. Okay. So Terrifics. Terrifics, uh, it's only had two issues so far. It's kind of, apparently the story arc is just going to be, the first story arc is just three issues before they, go into anything further and I've enjoyed it I, I have it it's um it's kind of a nice nice small story it just it's just an kind of introduction for them being uh like becoming a team because essentially they're not they're just they these three go into like the dark multiverse they find her, bring her back, and then they kind of, they're forced, they're now forced to become a team. Which, uh, it's, which is explained in Terrifics number two, which I will review, uh, I don't want to spoil it yet. Um, definitely enjoyed Terrifics, would recommend it, it's good. <laughs> That's all I can say, it's good. <laughs> then we have Silencer. Silencer, um, hmm, silence is the thing, <laughs> it is, it just, I don't know what I could say about it, it's not bad, but it's, it's kind of okay, that could be, that could be because I don't really like a lot of special agent, like mercenary genres that aren't, you know, Deathstroke, <laughs> but, hmm, I don't know. Silo has Silencer is okay, but it is, it hasn't really interested interested me as much. Um, would I recommend? Uh, I'd say up to you. Like, I know what a lot of people dislike is uh, Ramita Junior's art style for this because he has a kind of he has a specific art style, and so I think depending on the genre, it work how it works well with. With a special agent one, to a degree, yes, but overall it's a bit, mm, it's a bit, uh, like, it's not bad, but could have been a bit better. I don't know. I'm not an artist, so it, <laughs> I wouldn't know how that works. Uh, next we have Sideways. Uh, teleportation Spider-Man. <laughs> it's essentially, it's just, uh, I picked this one up and... I was a bit iffy on it because there was this whole like kind of thing with Justin Jordan here where on the day of its of of its release he just started blocking people for I believe it was for no reason at all and it's like do I really want to support something where one of the members of the creative team are just blocking people for no reason so that's a bit iffy I just like well I said I was going to pick him up and try him anyway so I see and 
it's a, it's a nice tale. Like, it starts off okay. It gets a little bit better. I do like the art style. With it, um... Although, Jordan isn't the main writer. Um, Dan Didio is the main writer, I believe. So, I think he's just a... He's a letterer. Yeah. I believe so. He's just the letterer. So, if you have any worries about that, it's just like... He's not the writer. He's writing something else in New Age of Heroes, but he's not the writer. But this is a kind of nice little tale. It's kind of... It's a... Almost a coming of age. No, since it's a New Age of Heroes. Like... Him realising that he can't mess around with his powers. That his powers have consequences and side effects. Uh, which would you know if you... Read the series. Uh, but anyway, to... The last one. Damage. Damage so far... I have really enjoyed Damage. The one I did not really have much hopes for or was interested in, I have really, really enjoyed. Damage has surprised me. It has been a better Hulk than the current Hulk at Marvel. I mean, essentially it is. It's just... And it's a very, like, um... Dr. Jekyll, Mr. Hyde, um, relationship between Damage and, um... And his, uh... Was the uh, his name Avery, I believe, or Ethan, no, or Elvis? I thought it was called. He has too many names. <laughs> I just damage. He's just damage. And I, uh, it's just him trying to. It's just essentially like a Hulk story. Just him trying to control the beast within. Trying to. He doesn't want to be. He doesn't want to cause damage to society. But he realized he's been lied to by the government because he's. He was built as a, he was created as a government experiment, and now he's gone rogue, which is the basic, basic premise of Damage, but I've really enjoyed it, I've really, I've surprised by how much I've enjoyed it, um, so that's it for the video, it just, kind of just a so far on like, what I think of New Age of Heroes, it's, it's ranged from okay to enjoy, and or good. I think I'm mainly waiting for a lot of the other titles to come out because they're the ones I was like, yep, I definitely need to pick that one up. So stuff like the Immortal Men, uh, New Challenges, uh, the Unexpected, those ones I just like, yep, I those look cool. The premises have got me interested. I definitely want to pick those up. But I'll be picking everything up. Like, I want to try everything. Because maybe there is something that I like that that initially didn't interest me. Like, Damage. <laughs> damage didn't interest, it, interest me when it was first announced. I picked it up. It's definitely one of my favourites. <laughs> so, that's it for the video. Just a, yes, just a so far on the new Age of Heroes. And I'll see you all next time.